I am so running out of batteries here. I don't even know what kind of batteries these take. I know I've had a vlog where I've talked about this before. I think it's like one of those freaking weird batteries. Um, hey guys, see the sweat? Oh look, it's a vlog, just about a piece of sweat going down my arm. Um, no, the reason I wanted to come out here in the midst of sweating like a pig is because a lot of what I want to do going forward, I have lots of props to show you, um, is tell you about the stuff I'm doing at home. Um, ideally, um, we'll be able to shoot some videos, but I'm also going to be really um, mixing up my workouts a lot. You know, different kinds of workouts I'm going to mix up. Isolation training, home DVD training, um, and then really fun stuff. Not that it's not all fun. You guys know I really enjoy it. Like, I love working out at the gym and going really heavy and doing like old-fashioned, good old isolation training, right? Why do I feel like my eyes look brown today? Strange. Um, it's, by the way, side note, it's, it's like pouring rain out and very dark. So, I should probably. Oh, and a side note, by the way, you saw me wear this in one of my last videos, but I didn't even realize this. This is that Under Armour uh, headband. I'm quite excited about these headbands, A, because they're thicker. They do make, you know, a lot of the thin ones, which are not as much my bag. I, I like the thick ones. Did I say that right? But when I wore this the other way, I really don't feel like taking this off for you. Uh, the uh, other way, it has little like grabby things. So when I wore it this way, this is very smooth. And it was riding up a little bit. Not a ton, but enough so that I kept taking it off. And then I'm like, oh, it's reversible. So then I turned it around and this really grips the hair and stays. Anyway, uh, back to the workout. So I'm going to be doing working out at home working out at the gym, and then probably this could be done either at the gym or at home, but I've got all this good stuff, like I've got muscle ropes, I have my, um, gosh, what's that thing called? Uh, Zuzana had it in the beginning, you know, it's kind of like the gym bar thingies, what is it called? The ultimate gym or ultimate something? Ultimate sandbag training, kettlebells, um, Dynamax balls, um, all of this stuff that, you know, is, is a little bit more functional metabolic training if you will but oh I, I don't like this song hold on this is the boring most boring song ever I don't know why it's on my oh this is not so a couple of things I just discovered I, I really don't read directions when I start using something so today I'm using um, the armor 39 and I, I found this out by mistake. I'm sure that they probably showed me this when I was out there, but so this is the view that I usually have. And I'm using the iPhone app, okay? So um, as you can see, I'm at about 444 calories. What I did today, which I'm gonna get into, is Kathy's Cardio Leg Blast, which I'll get to that in, in 10 seconds. She rocks. Um, so this is about an hour. And in an hour, I've burned about 445 calories. But what I didn't realize is, this is what happens when I turn this app on. And you know what? I might even show you a demo of what it, how cool it looks when you turn it on. This is a little loud. Oh, and it's lightning. I'll probably get a power. Do you hear that? It's kind of scary out. So, but look, I didn't even realize. So this is right now my intensity because I'm sitting here talking to you guys. So obviously. <laughs> But what happens when I get really excited and I talk really excited? Oh, I thought it, oh look, my intensity went up to four. <laughs> um, so, oh look, see? Now I feel better about how many calories I burn during the day. Just kidding. Um, this is just the heart rate view, right? So this shows what my heart rate is for like the last, uh, I don't know, this is starting at, I think it's by seconds, I can't really tell. And then that shows my willpower overall. I believe that's willpower overall for the workout is 623. So a lot of you guys have asked about what, what is the willpower? How can it measure willpower? Your willpower is, um, it, I hope I'm saying this right. This is a number that's gonna show you, um, it takes into consideration your, your age, your weight, your maximum heart rate, and then what you, why do my eyes look brown? 
really, I'm just seeing a really weird reflection of myself. Um, maybe I'm changing my eye color. Anyway, um, so your willpower is a reflection of how, how much you pushed it, really according to the intensity of your heart rate. So for me, and here's the thing, so when I was talking to Chris and Tori about this, I was like, you know, I'm only at, well, my heart rate out there when we first set it up was set incorrectly because it had my maximum heart rate at 220, which I think I would be dead if my heart rate was 220. Um, but what Chris was telling me is that, you know, you're not supposed to hit a 9.5 or a 10 every workout. You should have variables. I've told you guys this in the past. You know that I'm dripping all over the counter. It's disgusting in a good way. I'm proud of it. Um, you're, you're not supposed to do that, and you guys know I have a tendency, especially when I'm, you know, looking to lose weight or fat, and I'm sure that's true of a lot of us, you're, you're always thinking more is better. You're always going to tend to look at something like this, and I'll go, oh, six, I was only at like 6.23. That sucks. Well, let me tell you something. I just had a great workout. I pushed legs harder yesterday. Did I do legs yesterday? What did I do yesterday? This week I'm focusing on all working out from home. And then next week, getting back to some heavier training. So I wanted to do more lighter, high rep type training this week um, to kind of get myself back into regular weights. I did a little bit of that last week and then next week we're going heavy and then we'll mix all of this up. So we'll be doing uh, lighter, more high intensity training, mixing it up with heavy isolation training, mixing it up with full body metabolic circuits and all of that good stuff. Um, I act like I know what I'm talking about, but I'm really just quoting other people. Um, so anyway, like I said, here's the cool thing. So I finished, wait, hold on. How do I get to the main screen? Okay, so this is my normal screen, right? So then when I finish my workout, I press stop. Are you not listening to me? Stop, and it hits that, right? And I hit end session. Are you sure you want to end? Yes. And then you get this nice little display. Hold on, I think it's still filling stuff up. Yeah. You see that? So it shows me that my average heart rate was 118. My peak rate, I got up to 151. Uh, average intensity, 41%. Hour and 10 for duration. Uh, 458 calories. Willpower, 623. And then I can also go to the next screen. That shows what my heart rate was. And then this shows what my intensity was. So you can see the type of uh, training, which is really kind of cool because of course then, so I'm gonna hit exit workout results, saves my session. Now, I haven't yet figured out or done how I dump these results into, you know, cause I'm pretty sure that you can print all this stuff out and all that, but typical me, I just start using it and I'm impatient. But I wanted to show you how cool this looks when you start it up. Well, wait a minute. So it's just, I'm a nerd like this, this kind of stuff. Like, so when you first press, hopefully it'll do it. I was hoping that you, or you know, no, hold on, I can show you. So this is what you get when you first turn it on. So I've got my, my band is on under here, okay? So, okay, so then you're gonna start. Now here's the other thing too. I don't do this yet, but see how it says you can select a willpower target? So, hold on, if I hit on, I can say, this is the willpower that I, I want to hit in this workout and it can help you track it. I haven't done that yet because I'm just starting to use this, but say I hit start workout, watch. Isn't that cool? Anyway, I think it's cool. Um, it's bright and it's fluffy. Exit. Okay, so exit workout results. I have to remember, because one time I left it running, I didn't hit exit. And that's why my annoying iPhone, iPhone. See, I'm already down in the battery, pisses me off. Anyway, uh, I'm at nine minutes, let me wrap it up. Ooh, yes, I'm gonna wrap it up, Mr. Flo. Um, couple of things. So we really have some exciting stuff coming up, you guys, and I put it in my last blog post, but by the time I put this video up, it'll probably be four posts ago. Um, we're really gonna be doing some end of the year amping things up with my BFF, Bill, uh, who is it? Ooh, look, I have some leftover Genetics HD. Maybe 
I don't. Um, I really like this stuff. Um, so he's going to be uh, training me. We're going to be profiling a ton of amazing athletes from figure competitors to bodybuilding folks, uh, some gym rats, some endurance athletes, triathletes. All of these people are going to be profiled with who they are, what they've done, what kind of training they do, what kind of supplementation they take. Not that they're prescribing it, just saying, hey, this is what I do. But you'll get to follow along with them, and I'm not even going to tell you what else is coming. But A, this is where I am going to start telling you guys. You need to be a member of Fitfluential. Go to fitfluential.com and sign up as a member. Just hit the join button. It's free. There's no contracts. You're going to start getting perks. And I might just mention that there might be perks around this or this or this. Um, so here's just a really quick preview. I'm still taking this in the morning. I do two scoops before my cardio. Uh, I am gonna ask Bill, because you guys know I bought this and I have yet to use it. Now, I looked at it, but he's gonna give me exactly what I need to take because what this says is, see your optimal dosing there on the back? It says, like if your goals are defined physique, you take one scoop, on training days post-workout, which is 20 grams of protein, non-training days you take one scoop in the morning. Now if your goal is lean sculpted physique, fuel fat metabolism, maximum lean muscle growth, improved strength, you take two scoops. I gotta ask Bill, this is the kind of thing that kind of confuses me because I'm like, okay, I mean I get it, but does somebody, you know, would, would women amp up protein that much? So I'm gonna have to ask him. Um, 40 grams, I've never done like 40 grams. So the other thing, that <laughs> I don't know why they haven't figured out how to make these so you don't rip up the packaging, but my friend Dutch, um, he's Ranger Dutch on Twitter, he's a triathlete, he told me about, he's like, we would be talking at night and he's like, oh yeah, I've taken this GNC recovery stuff that puts me to sleep. I'm like, what GNC stuff puts you to sleep? I really didn't think that anything other than 17 Advil PM would put me to sleep. You guys know I have issues sleeping. Uh, so I went out and got this, and I gotta tell you, A, I love the taste. It's kind of like the whole fuzzy, fizzy taste of like the Pro Sculpt and whatever. This comes in three flavors. I didn't know it. I got Fruit, fruit Blast, but apparently there's watermelon and something else. Um, tastes really good. I do two scopes. Two scoops. Um, there's, it says immediate six hour release. Leucine and glutamine to fuel recovery, primes the body for sleep, potential with key ingredients, muscle fueling components, features melatonin, L-theanine, GABA, mucana, whatever the hell that is, and D-aspartic acid, whatever that is. Uh, it also has magnesium, I know, in it, if I'm correct. God, I'll feel like an idiot if it doesn't. I think I'm starting to get old. I know I'm getting old, obviously, but I'm starting to get old in that when I look at things that's like that, the fine print. Is this made to make me feel old? Or it's made to make me maybe buy a different supplement that's gonna help my eyesight. <laughs> See, I'm in marketing, I know this stuff. But I'm like, anyway, I was so skeptical of this. I'm like, there is no way in hell I'm gonna put some scoops in water and it's gonna do what Advil PM does to me. It sounds pornographic, but I didn't mean to. All I'm telling you, and every single person that buys this and uses it says the same thing. They're like, OMG, this makes me sleep like a baby. I gotta tell you guys, I don't take Advil PM anymore. Never thought. Because I tried to take melatonin for a while, remember? Was taking melatonin wasn't working. So that's that. Here's my quick down and dirty. You guys know, Kathy sent me her X-Train set, which if you don't have all of her, I mean, any single workout that you buy from Kathy, I've been using her for probably 10 years. Um, they're advanced workouts for the home trainer. Their weight, their cardio. She is a badass, every single, and if you look at my Instagram, you'll see that other people will look at it and they'll make a comment on, on one of my um, workouts and they'll go, oh my God, I love her. Like everybody that's been using her stuff says that every single workout that they buy of hers, every DVD is amazing. So trust me, um, this is a set that as you can see, this is very thick. This has this many workouts. I talk about her all the time, but the thing is, typical Kelly, this is what I tend to do. I find one or two favorites and I do them again and again and again and again. And I don't even touch the rest of these. So I had done like chest, back and shoulders, but today what I did was disc six. You can look all this up on her website. She has a new set coming out. Cardio leg blast. Um, sometimes I would look at, at workouts like this 
and I would go, oh, you know, is this cardio? Is this weights? I'm confused, so I wouldn't do it. So, you know, what, I, what I'm doing this week is instead of like trying to label everything and worry about it, I did it. Now, what I would label this is, she says, cardio like, I'm gonna be at 15 minutes. I'm already at 15 minutes. I'll, I'll describe this later. All that said, you use a lot of weights. You do plyo, weights, plyo, weights, plyo, weights. 500 calorie burn in an hour, killer. I would consider this more of a cardio uh, workout with, you know, obviously you're doing some, some strength in there, um, more cardio in nature. Um, but I do her, her weight training videos and then I'm like, oh, that was weight training. Butts and guts, yeah. Anything that she makes that has to do with your butt, you're gonna wanna get that. So um, I have to go, it's 15 minutes and I'm sorry. <sighs> Damn, and I gotta go figure out why my eyes look brown. Maybe it's because it's Halloween coming up. Halloween is a month away. I gotta go make some coffee or something. I'll talk to you guys later. Have a great day.